Hi, I'm Susan Armstrong. I'm president of Brindle Septic Tank Services, LLC, and we are in White Lake, Michigan. We actually provide two types of service. The first one is we clean septic tanks, and the second one is we provide a portable sanitation solution to the construction industry, entertainment industry. I actually bought the business from a gentleman that had owned it for 45 years. Being a woman in this industry is very difficult. It is very male dominated. What motivates me is to actually improve the lives of my team and my customers. If I can help them professionally or personally to grow, get to the next level, then that really inspires me and motivates me to get up at that 4.30 in the morning and keep coming into the office day after day after day. The biggest risk I've ever taken as a business owner is buying this company. I was in a great job that I loved, and then all of a sudden, you know, the rug gets pulled out from underneath you and you have to decide whether you're gonna go do the safe thing and go get a corporate job or chase your dreams. I cashed in my 401k, I sold my house, took the equity of the house, all my savings, and I just threw it in a big pile and said, let's go for it. That was a huge risk. And doing that at my age, okay, sometimes I think I'm crazy, but crazy or not, I'm having a lot of fun. I didn't have a relationship with Fifth Third Bank until actually I started looking to buy a company. I went down the path with a lot of the other larger SBA banks that have done a lot of SBA loans, and I was really disappointed. At Fifth Third Bank, they bent over backwards for me. They literally went the extra mile. They gave me an offer that beat every other bank in town. Fifth Third has been one of the critical uh, team members to my team and my success. They are there to listen and to coach and advise me. Um, and that has been so helpful. We help our customers realize their goals by really investing ourselves in them. So this goes well beyond, you know, just supplying capital. You know, this is our time and attention to get to know them, their goals, their objectives, and the best way to help them reach their goals. The biggest roadblock to small businesses is capital. A lot of times they are undercapitalized when they start. They underestimate what their needs are to launch a product or service or to just get operations going. Oftentimes people are intimidated from talking to a bank or banker, but they're here to help. We don't exist without the customers and that's key. In order to guide the entrepreneurs toward really good financial decisions, we help them by understanding the long-term consequences for their short-term decisions. We have the tools that can help model the range of things that might happen based on the decisions they make today. And that really puts them on the best path to success for the long-term. Support system is critical. You know, you've got that saying, it takes a, a village to raise a child. It takes a village to get a company, you know, to the next level. Having that team around you who also will support you when you are having your hardest day, when you've lost faith in yourself and hope, and, and they go, you got this, you got this, and then you know you do.